Yeah, it's a root tattoo. They're low. Brian, I have followed her whole career ever since she was the little pig who went oink oink. I told you she'd grow up to be hot. You couldn't say that then, and you can't say it now. Did and did. Ah, I'd love to, Chris. <sighs> I'm out. Better call in Boston Dynamics Dad instead. Come on, sport. No, I'm fine. A couple hard sniffs and a spit and I'll be good. <laughs> Just recording a new talk to Meeba's song. Don't you think that song's a little too dirty for a baby to be singing? You know, you shouldn't eat Taco Bell. Meeba says you should only eat organic food because it's better for the environment. And I'm more than just a fan. I'm a marionette. You don't get it. She sees the world in a way you won't ever see, Brian. With blues and greens? Y uh, well, yeah, I guess that too. <laughs> Meeba concert, please. Oh, I'm a dumb dog. A few options we could try. You can increase your exercise. Pass. Switch to a vegan diet. I'd rather die. Or quit drinking. Oh my god, this is worse. Oh. I did stuff with the stripper at the bachelorette party. Time to immortalize this moment with a photo because pictures at concerts always turn out great. Oh, Meeva responded! Uh-oh. And, and Stewie, Stewie Griffin, Griffin is a, is a bully. bully. Is this it? The pleather jacket with every NFL logo on it? Is that a Glen plaid car coat with a fur line collar? I have a chewed up walking stick with gum on it. Right here, brah. All items accounted for. Not good. The marionettes are still attacking me. All my accounts are being flooded. They doxed my favorite Froyo place. Hey guys, you know, this virus of hate has infected my entire world. And I saw this video of this Italian guy playing the trumpet. I would love to, Chris, but like all people who undergo drastic weight loss, I have time to make up for. What's everyone thinking for playtime? Hi, I'll speak for the group. We heard about what you did, Stewie. Preschool is supposed to be more about socialization than education. This could have lasting long-term damage. Anybody? Go away, Brian. I've already made my decision. There's nothing you can say that will change my mind. I'm on your side. Thanks, Brian. Can you tweet that? An online ally would be really helpful right now. You were gonna get through this, champ. Coward and friend. He blew up! I had an IT band blow up last year. He had a spacesuit? Yes, he wanted to be an astronaut, but he got disqualified because of an astigmatism. I start whining when people cry because it sounds like a fire truck. It's just so unfair. It's like Nelson Mandela said. This will be wrong. With great power comes great responsibility. Yeah, that's Spider-Man. Peter, get out of that cocoon! It's a chrysalis! Being less toxic to cave dwellers such as birds and reptiles. Thank you. Wow, very impressive, Patty. I learned a lot. And an electric discovery. Prizing F of the day goes to... I'll be his kite. Chris Griffin. Make me your kite. It's working! Dump. <laughs> Did you hear that, Dad? I won! Loud hiss, hot brain! I couldn't have done it without you. Hey, Meba! Stewie, don't! Killing her is not gonna fix this. I'm the guy who insulted you online. I'm the oink oink guy. Wasn't that like 12,000 TikToks ago? Like Justin Timberlake could have apologized to Britney in private instead of notifying the world what he was doing. Instead of listening to celebrities, maybe we should take on that same enthusiasm and listen to scientists. Nice speech, Stewie. A lot of good it did. Look at them, they don't care. They're lost. I have someone I want you to meet. Rupert! I stitched him back together. Thanks, Brian. And if I'm honest, I was to blame for said difficulties. What do you say we try to have that catch again? I would love to, Chris. <sighs> Can you stop laughing? A robot is railing my mom. Like I said, IG Live.
All right, Meg's going for her phone. She, oh, nope, she's just scratching herself. Just, just be cool on there. Boy, he's sure living a lot longer than we expected. The doghouse! Okay, no viewers yet. I'll do it again. Hopefully I can keep that energy. And we got at Learn Guitar in seven days on the line. Let's get started. You know what? I will ask him a question. Give me your phone. Well, anyway, I have a proposal for the two of you. Well, this ought to be interesting. Ooh, the Quag's got a girlfriend. Hey, get off me! We don't have that kind of relationship. So go on, Meg. Hello, Brian. As a famous writer, you are now eligible to become a verified account. Yes! <gasps> oh, my God. It's her. I had horrible acne. I had to wear a back brace, and to make things worse, only one of my boobs had come in. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's Scully Lois. What a freak. I just ate a sandwich, so I'm waiting 20 minutes to swim. No one even tried to help. What a loser. <laughs> Walk much? 18 more minutes. I got verified on Instagram. Look at that, a blue check. Thank you, Comploted. Huh, it's not how you spell completed. I got hacked. Oh, I'm so mad that hacker has me seeing gray. Red. It's red, Brian. I think you should just give your account to the hacker. I mean, your Instagram wasn't setting the world on fire. I, I may have sent some weird DMs to Zendaya that I'd rather not see the light of day. You have aged infuriatingly well. So how did you two meet? Did you both escape from the same sex cult? I didn't really need that whole parade. And how did you two meet? Lois was dating another guy, and I threatened to kill myself. She ate a lot of shellfish, and her back was curved like a shrimp. <laughs> I've never meant this before. Being a mom is the most fulfilling job in the world. Oh, do you have kids? Be careful how you answer this. Excuse me, some of the other diners have complained that you're not talking loudly enough. They're loving these stories. I feel sorry for Stephanie now. Really? What part? The good skin and a great job. Oh, pfft, french fries. French fries. No, kids, you do the math. Anyway, point is, I won dinner. Good, she looked right at my hands. What does that mean? Age comes out in the hands, Peter. Maybe she's trying to figure out how old I am. I love that she had to ask what Caprese was. What a dumb bitch. What? What's going on with your face? There is? Ah, oh, son of a bitch! Lois, what the hell's going on with you? I don't know. Have we ever been alone in a room together before? So, Instagram update. We're talking! How do you know how to speak Russian? If you watch enough super dark videos on the internet, eventually you're gonna learn Russian. Peak hours. Yep, just what I thought. Chelabinsk. That was fast. What business meeting? I sell bikini swimsuits for men of size. You mean fat guys? No. Are you here for business or displeasure? We're here to find the hacker that- Stole your Instagram, yes. <laughs> what do you want? Dr. Hartman, I have no idea what's going on. Photo. I did. I ran into a girl who terrorized me in junior high, and she used to call me Scully Lois. You see, all nerds are one tossed-off joke away from reverting to their worst, most humiliating selves. Why don't we go find out? Let me handle this. At the Brian Griffin. Do Kralevo Instagram? Da. I sorry. So Brian Griffin, is this beautiful American wife? Me? No. I only stole account because it made me feel like I was living happy American life of big writer man. I lived in puddle for a while, but sun dried up my house. I yell at sun, give it back! But it never does. I don't understand why the man who can't go swimming has a pool party. Once the harness is fixed, I can be lower. Humiliated me? I I'm sorry, Lois. There's a guy here who's fatted me, and I'm just checking out his front meat. Soon as I unclasp my hernia girdle. <laughs> we all see them. I don't see them. Above the knee on a left thigh. You pushed me. Hey, Lois, watch your step. Your shoe's untied. Ah, ah, ah. This whole time, you never bullied me? No. 
I always admired how you persevered through all these burdens. That means it's your turn to service me in bed. No, Peter, that's only when I'm wrong about something having to do with you. Brian, we came here to find your account, but found something much more valuable. My happiness. Last night, when Ivan made love to me... Ah, no, 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 please, no, please, no, stop, no, stop, no, stop. no, no. He said... We probably ought to tally up expenses from the trip. Oh, um, okay. Peanut butter and chocolate looks good. Sounds like a group expense to me. No way, Meg, wouldn't you call that a personal... Oh, she's gone. Yep. Also known as cattle plague, which has been eradicated from most of the world, except from here. I think this relationship has... If you leave me, I will kill myself. <sighs> You know, I don't mind so much that you're aging. It's just the way you're shoving it down my throat. Screw you, Peter. Not today. <laughs> oh, wow! Really, I have a boyfriend. His name is Anthony. Jolly farm. <laughs> Can't believe you still watch this crap. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down! See, that was actually written about the bubonic plague. They're going to be making an American version of Jolly Farm right here in Quahog. Oh, my God, I didn't see that. Gimme! Seven dead in Mumbai. I like their hats. Meg's boyfriend. But there's, there's nothing wrong with him. He seems to be completely normal. Oh. I can honestly say for the first time that I am attracted to our daughter. Thanks for having me over for dinner. Uh, come on, Pete. I think Anthony wants some time alone with Meg. Has anybody ever told you you're pretty enough to be a movie star, Mrs. Griffin? Look, Anthony, trust me. She ain't what she used to be, all right? Once you get those pants off, it's like two sagging pressed hams and a slice of pizza. Oh, I forgot my... <laughs> oh, my God. That's kind of hot. Sorry. All the boys can go home. We only have one part left for a little girl. What? No! No, that's impossible! Karina Smirnoff. Hello, everyone. The bomb that went off in Times Square? My cousin works in Times Square. Well, your cousin is fine because I was acting. That's impressive. Oh, you're hired. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Well, you're going to think I'm an awful person, but I'm attracted to another man. Giggity. It's Meg's boyfriend, Anthony. It's healthy to explore your sexuality. Oh, I don't know. It just feels like I'm lying to Peter. I'm wondering if you wouldn't mind buying me a drink. Well, that'd be my pleasure. Uh, maybe later I can show you some of the local points of interest. There's one right below the table. Lucky for you, I like bold men. Karina, Karina Smirnoff. Brian, I've been missing a woman's touch. Brian, Brian, it's me, Stewie. I'm gonna kill you. Why are you dress like that? Uh, because I'm the star of Jolly Farm. Remember how they only needed little girls? Brian, we both know I touched it. Now, if you'd like to keep that just between us, I suggest you sit back down and order me some chicken fingers. She'll be playing the role of Mary. Hello? Hi, I'm Julie. Don't mind Randall. He's getting into character. Is he playing a dick? Hey, Mary, bet I'll beat you to the barn. That sounds like a really chauvinistic presumption. Karina, your line is, that sounds fun. Yes, Dan, but I felt that just because we're on a farm, it doesn't mean we have to be stuck in the 19th century with our value system. She'll be gone in three episodes. Your husband's work and poker game schedule? My menstrual cycle's on there too, but I don't mind if you don't. Okay, now me. Oh, that's a stop sign! The other day you said I was attractive. Now what are we gonna do about it? Oh my god, wow. This is so cool. Mm, mm, mm. Mom, I forgot my keys. Do you know where... Um... Hey, another batch of fan mail, Karina. Oh, careful, Sam. You're emptying your sack all over me. <laughs> what? You have such a youthful look, you could pass for 11 months. Ugh, then why do I feel like 40 months? Whenever I talk to her, it makes my band-aid start to peel off. What are you talking about? I'm talking about my thing. Gotta hide it for the cameras. Uh, hi. Do I know you? Oh, right. Yeah, no, you, you don't. Uh, you know Karina. I'm her brother, Stewie. Why don't you keep her company while I go fetch Karina? Just make sure you get her fast. Karina? Yes? You know, we're all sick of you. That's right, all of us. Sick of me? Oh, that's rich! You know, I wasn't going to say this, but Mother hates you! Two lemonades, Brian. Oh, yeah, I'll go make you a lemonade. 
I'll make you a fresh one. I thought maybe you and I could have a sleepover tonight. You know, a little girl time. Oh, that would be so fun. Yes, let's. I'm not talking to you. You're being a baby. Go say goodbye. Why, she's your friend. And why should I do you any favors after the terrible things you said to me earlier? Meg, honey, I think we need to talk. I don't want to talk to you. Get out. Look, I understand that you're upset. You couldn't steal him from me. Well, I do know a few things, Meg, and clearly if I wanted him, I could have him. This is about power tools. Yeah, I go to places you couldn't get back from. I'll do anything. You don't know me. So, I guess I sleep in the guest room or whatnot? No, you can sleep in here with me. Oh, well... Why couldn't we just have girlfriends instead of boyfriends? I know, it's all just one big confusing mess. You've made me feel so unattractive lately that I went and did something disgusting and abhorrent and I'm ashamed of myself. Peter, I made out with Meg's boyfriend. I think you're the most beautiful woman I ever seen in my life. Well, but then why have you been saying all these horrible things? Because I'm old and fat and unattractive and worthless. Maybe I like fat guys. You do? Maybe I like having sex with fat guys. Yeah? No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm not done yet. Karina, what are you... Mm. Oh, if only you were a boy. But I've got something to say, Mother Maggie. You do? Well, maybe that can wait till later, Mary. No, I think this needs to come out now. I'm Desmond Sunflower, Desmond Sunflower, and I'm a boy. <gasps> Did you talk to Julie? Her mother won't let me see her. Doesn't matter anyway, she's back with Randall. Oh, I'm sorry. You want to get some ice cream? Well, why not? I don't have to fit in that dress anymore. <laughs>